Hey, what's going on guys? I'm going to talk to you today about the truth about the COVID-19 situation in South Korea. Yes, their holiday that had just happened was called Chuseok. And Chuseok is like Korean Thanksgiving where families go, um, typically they go from Seoul. Uh, people will go from Seoul back to their hometowns and visit their families in their hometown. But not just Seoul, Busan, Daegu, Daejeon, a lot of major cities. Well, South Korea had over 3,000 new COVID-19 cases for the first time, and that has been expected because a lot of people, after getting vaccinated, which 74% of South Koreans have at least had one jab of the COVID-19 vaccine. They've at least had one jab of it. So a lot of them chose to take the risk, and they chose to go from Seoul back to their hometowns and visit their families to honor an ancient old Korean tradition. But here's the other side of it. That, the, that many anti-vaxxers do not want to hear. Now, here's the other side of that. Yes, 3,000 new cases happened. And if people are going to choose to celebrate Chuseok and be around their families and go traveling from Seoul back to their hometowns, that's inevitable. 77% of the new COVID-19 cases had originated in Seoul. Okay, but here's the thing. Only six new deaths were added to that total. So there were only six new COVID-19 deaths, which I believe brought the total in South Korea to 2,441. Um, some sources said it was 2,448 deaths total. In South Korea, a person has a 0.82% chance of dying of the COVID-19 if they get it. And that is a less than 1% chance because the majority of South Koreans have been vaccinated from, they've gotten the COVID-19 vaccine. And so the amount of hospitalizations and ICU intensive care unit cases in South Korea are rare as well as deaths from COVID-19. And that's what people need to realize because a lot of South Koreans have gotten the vaccine and they've also been very, very conscious about still wearing a mask and still social distancing. And um, I wish we would do more of that in the States. So, hope everybody's doing well. Take care. God bless you. Bye-bye.